Hello, this is Kevin with 3G Store, and today we're going to take a look at the CloudGate LTE and show you how easy it is to switch carriers. In the background, we have our Option CloudGate LTE. We already have the back cover removed, four screws keep this into place, and this is where the SIM card inserts into the device. Right now there is power, two antennas for cellular, and then our LTE SIM card for Verizon installed. We also have a computer connected by Ethernet to the single LAN port, and that's where we're looking out the admin interface in the background. We're going to log in with the default settings of admin and admin, and head over to the LTE interface. You can see right now that it already shows as connected to the cellular network. It shows Verizon as the operator, a negative 85 signal strength, and it shows us connected on LTE. Being a global LTE modem though, you can run multiple carriers. We're going to remove the Verizon SIM card and then insert an AT&T SIM card. This is active with 3G and LTE service, so it should connect up for us right away. We're now going to go into the interface again, head over to the System tab, and then perform a system reboot. Whenever you're switching connections, you just have to do a quick reboot. It only takes a little over a minute and a half to do this. We'll speed things up here so we can watch that happen. While that is rebooting, we'll zoom in real quick here and show you where the SIM card actually inserts into the device. There's just a simple SIM card slot, it just clicks in and out. The SIM card goes in notch side first, gold contacts facing down, and that is as simple as it is to switch carriers on this device. Okay, now with the CloudGate rebooted, we're back at the login screen. We'll put the default username and password of admin back into the device and click log in. We'll head over to the exact same spot. Looking at just the home screen, you can see it already says we're connected to the internet. So let's get a little bit more details. Go over to interface and click LTE connection. And you can see we are now on AT&T's network. With nothing more than a simple SIM change, we've now switched carriers on LTE. And the additional information you get here is IP information for your connection. You can do some specifics on how you want the cellular modem to be enabled. And for different carriers like T-Mobile, Verizon that require specific APNs, you can specify those here in the interface. You even get a data counter to tell you how much mobile data you have gone through. For more videos like this, don't forget to subscribe to our channel, and for more information on the CloudGate and its expansion modules, visit 3gstore.com cloudgate.